Uh, the Damascus fire is currently at 250 acres. It is 75% contained at this time. Uh, the Florida Forest crews, along with our partnering agencies, Volusia County, City of Deland, City of Port Orange, City of New Smyrna, uh, U.S. Fish and Wildlife, uh, they all did an incredible job yesterday. Uh, had it contained, uh, it took a couple of hours to contain, but you know, we didn't have, uh, Mother Nature was not on our side. We had high, high winds, low relative humidity, and uh, some very uh, volatile vegetation that they were battling in. And how, what, are, what will they be doing today, Julie? Today we brought in some uh, heavy equipment out of the Orlando district to, uh, you know, improve those lines that they've created, those fire lines that they did last night uh, to contain the fire. They'll be improving those lines. Uh, they're just going to be doing mop-up, as you can see, uh, Volusia County Fire has been doing some mop-up over here in this area. Our focus this morning is mop-up along 44 uh, to, to really, you know, uh, try to keep that smoke down. Is there a chance that if the wind picks up again this afternoon, the road might close again? There is a possibility. We are working with our partners at FHP. In the event that we need to close the road, uh, we will do so. Um, we also want to remind our viewers that the move over law does apply to uh, wildland firefighters and firefighters in general. Um, if you see uh, equipment on the side of the road working and you see lights, please move over. If you are unable to move over, please slow down. And how many fires is the Bunnell District of the Forest Service monitoring or watching at this time? Sure. I believe the last count in the Bunnell District, we had 16 open fires that we are currently working. I know that they were able to uh, close out a couple of fires yesterday, um, but of course we had this new fire and a couple up in St. John's. And do we know yet how this fire started? We don't. Uh, the main goal is to get out here, contain the fire, uh, work on mop-up, and then we'll come back and look at a cause. And what can people do to prevent wildfires? Well, obviously there is a burn ban here in Volusia County, so we just ask that you adhere to that burn ban, no burning. Um, you know, if you're going to have a barbecue, make sure you're doing it with a gas grill. Um, Please don't throw your cigarettes out the window. Um, Fourth of July is coming. However, there is a burn ban. So we just ask that you be careful. Clearing out uh, 30 feet of space between your home, uh, the back of your home and the woods, making sure you have a, a, a good space. And uh, there's nothing that can catch on fire between the back of your home and the woods. Including cleaning gutters. Yes. Anything that's on your roof, like leaf litter, pine needles, uh, things of that nature, just make sure you get up there safely and uh, clean your roofs off and your gutters. Super. And whenever there's a firefighter, should people from the neighborhood ride over to check out the action? No. Uh, you know, you got to give them some space and some time to do their job. Uh, everybody loves a firefighter. Everybody loves our wildland firefighters. But uh, when it's all said and over, you can stop by the Forestry Center and uh, thank them. Thank you. Thank you.